Hi everyone, I'm Teacher Faye from Blue Tree Education Learning Center. Are you ready to learn math with me? Let's go! The first four figures of a pattern are shown below. The table below shows the number of squares used for each figure and fill in the numbers for figure 5. If we take time to analyze how the diagram looks like, the number of grey squares for the first figure is 1 and for the second figure is actually 2 on the first level and then 2 on the third level. So the, the colours goes like alternate grey, white and grey. And as for figure 3, the number of squares has increased to match the figure number. So there's 3 on each row, so it goes grey, white, grey, white. And when it goes to figure number four, there will be four on each row. And this time round, there will be five uh, rows. So you'll be gray, gray, white, gray, white, gray. And you can see that in figure three, there will be equal number of gray and white squares, just like figure one. And this applies to odd number of figures. And as for figure number five, we are expecting five squares on each row. Okay, so there will be equal number of grey and whites, which will look like this. So it will be three rows of greys and three rows of whites. Grey, white, grey, white, grey and white. And that is how we find the answer to the grey squares, which is 15, and the white squares, which is 15 as well. Are you ready for part B? How many white squares are there in figure 15? In figure 15, it is actually an odd number of uh, figure, the odd number figure. So there we will realize that the figure 15 has 16 layers okay so let's take a look again at the table when it is odd figure number one you see that there are two layers layer one and layer two when it's figure number three it's one two three four it will be the figure number plus one. So from this, we figure out that the pattern, that if it's figure 15, it will be 16 layers, 15 plus one, 16 layers. And in this 16 layers, it will be equally distributed into eight layers of white and eight layers of gray. Hence, in order to find the number of white squares in figure 15, it will be 8 times 15, which is 120 white squares. Are you ready for part C? How many grey squares are there in figure 80? Figure 80 is a even number. So figure 80 has 81 layers. There will be 40 layers of white and 41 layers of grey. It will always be one more. Just take a look at the figure or the table to have a clearer idea of what happens to those greys and white layers that's, for, that's happening in the figure number that's even. So let's take a look at figure number two. You can see that figure number two will have two layers of grey and one layer of white. There will be more greys than white. Take a look at figure number four. So four minus one, there will be three. So there will be three layers of grey and two layers of white. Okay. And the total number of layers will be actually the figure number plus one. So let us recap. If it's figure number 80, there will be a total number of 81 layers. But in terms of the grey, okay, there will be one more than the white. So 
If it's an odd number or figure number, it will be equal number. But if it's an even number, there will be more grays than white. So how many gray squares are there? In figure 80, there will be 80 squares on each row. So 80 times 41 will give us the answer 3,280 squares in this figure 80. So watch the video replay again to have a deeper understanding.